a very, very, very busy week. Once again, fertilizing. What is it? Grass food. We dealt with a new build property, a new build property where new turf had just been put down on top of all the building material, particularly a lot of rubble. <laughs> Good morning my lawn lovers, it's Monday, checking in with you, it's an absolute pleasure. Right then folks, as you can see from this lawn, we've got an abundance of weeds. Weeds are now back in growth and with that in mind, they are also very responsive to weed killing treatment. So I've got my knapsack sprayer on, loaded with weed killer. We use a product called Celadon, so I'm going to spray this lawn. Good morning my lawn lovers. Right then folks, some good news. Today, I've got an absolute special for you. We are on a typical new build estate typical new build property absolutely no question whatsoever the level of effort and detail that is put in to building these new properties i don't think there's any question though and it has to be said the level of effort involved in putting down the new turf is just not good enough what happens is more often than not and i don't think i've ever seen a case where this isn't the case the builders literally just put new turf down on top of all their hardcore and all their rubble. As a result, I'm going to spin this round soon and you'll see that the grass just doesn't survive. Grass is no different to any other root. Well, sorry, grass is no different to any other plant. It needs to have strong roots. If you put that new turf down on top of soil and rubble, it's just not going to survive. Let me spin this round. So there was nothing worth saving on this lawn. I was here about three or four weeks ago. Right, I'm on a customer's lawn and uh, after further consultation with my experienced colleagues at True Green and with the customer, we have agreed that on this particular lawn, which you're gonna see in a minute, there's absolutely nothing worth saving. So we are gonna take the lawn back to soil and then come back and reseed it. I'm going to be putting down a product called Roundup Pro, which just kills everything inside. But this is a typical new build property, I'm afraid, where, like I say, the builders put all the effort and attention into building the house, but absolutely no attention and detail is put into the preparation of the lawn. New turf is just literally put down on top of all this rubble and just all the building material. So we're here to dig down a good few inches and we've got some topsoil on its way and then we're gonna reseed. Okay guys, our best crack on. Halfway through the day, well, it's about half 12. We were here for about half eight. Um, we're the customer on a typical new build property. So at the customer's request, at their expense, the tide is skip. I'm gonna spin everything around for you in a minute. We've had a skip, so we've taken a lot of stuff away. Uh, the topsoil is here, which we're now wheeling through the front door into the back garden. So let me just spin this around and show you what's going down. So, skip is literally full to the brim. We've got this topsoil here. Uh, it's around 800 kilos per bag. On the positive news, two bags have already been wheeled into the back garden. So that is it folks, we got here about uh, half eight, nine o'clock. It's 
it's probably closer to about half five now and uh, we are out of here that is six bags of 800 kilos 800 kilos times six bags of topsoil and a huge skip of all the rubble and hardcore has been removed thanks for tuning in right yes of course i'm with a customer i'm on a customer's lawn i'm gonna spin this round for you in a minute I'm here to get a fertilizer down. What is fertilizer? What is the point? Grass food, really important. Grass food, packed with nutrients. You need to get it down at least every eight weeks. Very, very, very important. So we're nearly into June and I'm gonna be putting down what's called an 11.55 plus 8%. Any further questions on that, let me know and get yourself the right spreader. This lawn does need a bit of food. Sorry, I keep looking down at the lawn. It's what I need to do. Fertilizer, get the right one, get a spreader, get it down on your lawn every eight weeks. Good morning, my lawn lovers. I'm back with a customer and he's a lovely guy, but he can't cut his lawn, but I can. That's why I'm here. So I come and see this customer around every four weeks. So I'll just spin this round. Grass is looking very green. This customer obviously does get other treatments from me, fertilizer treatment every eight weeks. Looking very, very nice, very, very nice and green. So as you can see, the grass is nice and long, nice and green. A couple of patchy areas here. And I'll get some fertilizer down as well later, but let's just crack on. So there you have it folks, Rich Lawns doing his good deed of the day. It's not all take, take, take. Every now and again, you've got to put something back in. Very, very elderly customer of mine come around and cut his grass for him every four weeks. Every eight weeks, get a fertilizer down. Rich Lawns, see you soon. So, very good customer of mine. Was here a few weeks ago, moss killer went down. That's doing its thing. And I'm back here with my scarifier. To scarify. Let me spin this round and you can see what's going down. Here he is. Here is the, uh, the lawn. See the patches there? That's the moss killer. That's done its thing. So, uh, we're gonna crack on as per all these things I do. It's now baking hot, but hey ho, I've still got a scarify. So, uh, should get a bit of a tan. Right then folks, that is Scarification complete, and uh, just gonna get some fertilizer down. I'm afraid I can't get that on film as I'm running out of battery, so I'll get back to you on that one, folks. Rich Lawns. Good morning, good morning, my lawn lovers. Right then, Kel Surprise. I'm on a customer's lawn. Of course I am. Where else would I be? I don't know. Right. This customer's lawn 
was heavily infested with the moss. You know the drill. Moss killer went down, came back and scarified it. In fact, this particular lawn has already been posted onto one of my lawn care weekly videos. So you'll recognize it when I spin it around in a minute. So moss killer went down, came back, scarified, fertilizer went down, we've reseeded it. Customers struggling to get out here and cut the lawn. Uh, the customer's lawn. Look at some of the, the length of the grass. It is like a jungle. So I've got to cut this, then it'll give me a better idea of what needs doing. I'm going to put a fertilizer down today, but there could be a little bit more reseeding to do. Okay, folks, let's crack on at speed. This morning, quite frankly, this looked like Sherwood Forest. I literally thought Robin Hood was going to come out with his bow and arrow. Thankfully, he didn't. So, this is the lawn that I've just cut. It was heavily infested with moss not so long ago. Muscular went down, it's been scarified. So, I'm gonna get a fertilizer down today. In terms of where it was, even by the customer's admission, I mean, I can see it as well. It is massively improved. We get this fertilizer down, which I know is gonna be extremely advantageous for the lawn. So let's get that down, folks. Right then, folks. I don't just look after your lawns. I look after your driveway here with a customer. They have got a bit of a problem with weeds on their driveway. I'm gonna spin this round in a minute, let you have a look. I've come prepared with a product called Roundup Pro. You've already seen me use this before. It's extremely deadly, guys. You've gotta be careful, keep it away from the lawn. You don't want it anywhere near the lawn. Otherwise, you can say bye-bye to that for a little while. But Roundup Pro, absolutely perfect on your driveway. So, you see there, he's got an absolute abundance of them. That's not a problem. And it's not a problem when you call Roundup Pro. Let me make that perfectly clear. Not a problem at all. And I think that's about it, folks. Click up there to get all my previous videos. Click there to get this week's video. And what's really important, what I really want you to do is, See there in the middle, just there. Press that there to subscribe, Rich Lawn.